Okay, let's try this again. So, welcome to another day of vlog September. So today is our last day in Chicago, and I'm feeling the wind right now, but it's really, really nice. I actually, there's a lot of wind today, but the weather is really, really nice. Um, even though I'm wearing like a big puffer jacket and everything, but it's okay. But yeah, we're gonna go to Giordano's now for the deep dish pizza, so I'm excited to try that. So, Shante, you ready for Giordano's deep pizza? Day. Deep dish pizza? Yeah. Right it better be good. Yeah, it better be good. Cause we're, and we're hungry. We're hungry. Are you ready for deep dish pizza? I'm ready. I got my lactose pills. <laughs> as you know. In two seconds, I'll be over. But I'm ready. I'm so excited. Do you have to pop it before? I have to take it or before no? because because if I don't, like that cheese will have me feeling like a different person. <laughs> and we're gonna be going on the plane, so I don't think you want. I don't want that. Yeah, that wouldn't be a good look. Yeah, but I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, so. Too. Okay, Shante, I'm really trusting you on this well, direction. I know, for what? <laughs> <laughs> Goodness, guys, look at our deep dish pizza. So, I have pineapple, onion, um, beef, and we also have green peppers. <laughs> Yo, everybody's just digging in. It smells really good. Mm -hmm. Shante, I'm waiting for you to do a taste test. Me, I want to do the quintessential snack. It's so hot. I just taste test. Ooh, look at that cheese though, look at that cheese. It's good up. The pasta is very pungent. Hey guys. Mm. Oh my gosh. Wow. <laughs> Good up. Very good. <laughs> oh, okay guys, so we're about to go up to the Willis Tower. Oh. Now we know why they call it the Willis City. Dorothy, is that you? Take me to the Wizard of Oz. <laughs> <laughs> Willis Tower. Unfortunately, because it's so so windy today, it's closed, so we cannot go to the sky deck or we can't go um, up the Willis Tower or whatever. So that sucks. Like every other day wasn't that windy until today. So true. <laughs> so yeah, we have an hour left before we're gonna head to the airport. We're trying to figure out what to do, but I feel like we're not gonna do anything unless we go to a museum. But. Mm, the black ensemble. Yeah, it's so unfortunate. But on another note, how do you say again? Giordano's? Giordano's? <laughs> Giordano's pizza was A1. It was really good. 
It was huge though, I couldn't finish the whole thing. You even got the smallest size. Yeah, we got the smallest size and I could not finish the whole thing. It was a lot, but it also had an appetizer, so that could be another reason. Um, it's called Bronze New Stable Museum of African American History. Mm. Okay, guys, wanna walk? Where are you walking to? We're gonna get, we're gonna blow away in the wind. You see the city? Let's, let's walk to the hotel. And then just let's do, thing. let's do a bus tour. You know when you up, up, that's, we have, we have literally, you can hop on and off 45 minutes, no 55 minutes. And hop on and off. So we can see the city and you not know, walk. Did you ever seen those buses anywhere? Down here. Exactly. My bet is we walk towards the hotel. You can see anything. Yeah, because you have all done. You have the view. <laughs> no, um, we can go to dessert. Light up to the bowl up. I know. We have a dessert. Except like, like my birthday cake. Okay, okay, let's walk. Wait, ice cream? That's the only thing I would have. It's light. I want, I want red velvet cake. <laughs> That's heavy. Like okay, let's go. Hasha go go, isn't that? Was that it? <laughs> what? The dessert place. Catch a go go? It was that a dessert place? Hasha go go? Or no? I've never heard of that. Hasha go go. Somebody said that to me. Walking in the windy city. We decided we wanted the experience, so we're just walking outside, and it's so windy, but it's beautiful. I know the architecture here is actually just so nice. Like downtown, the buildings are huge. You look at that. It's kind of scary. I feel like we're in like a movie, you know, like hey, uh, in the low. future movie. Hello? No, thank you. Go. Hey. <laughs> There you go. Oh, shit. So I'll take a time. That'll be. Okay. It's a walk off? It's a battle thing. Let me move back here. Okay. Five. We have Shanti on the left, Shanice on the right. Do we have, we have Naomi Campbell and Tyra Banks. And go. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Chante, don't walk backwards, I'm afraid. Okay. Hit it, hit it. Open that jacket, girl. <laughs> Who won that? All right, comment down below if you think okay. Naomi Banks won it. Naomi Banks. <laughs> Naomi Campbell or Tyra Banks. Competition, no competition. What's up guys? So today is the next day and I, yeah, today's the next day since my trip. Um, as you can see, I'm back home. I'm just in my room and as you can see, I took out my ponytail. That's because I was so over it. Um, it just feels so weird and just so uncomfortable to have your, like, hair in one constricted spot for like days and days and days. Like, I don't know how people just have a ponytail on their head forever. Do people even do that anymore? I don't know. But mine was so down to um my hair so that's why it was very unmovable so literally as soon as i got home like at five o'clock in the morning i'm like no i'm not doing another night with this in my head so i just cut it all out it was a struggle at first i was like lord hope i don't cut my hair off but i didn't um it didn't hurt or anything like that like there was like there was one point in my hair like or my head that it hurt but it wasn't really really bad it was just annoying just to have that right there so like if i wanted to turn and sleep on that side i couldn't do it so i'm the type of girl who likes to have my hair out i like to have it you know 
up whenever I want so I like to scratch my head I like to put my hands in my hair and I just couldn't do that with the ponytail by all means definitely a good style to do if you don't want to do shit to your hair you can just slick down your edges and you're good to go and it looks bomb with like any outfit you wear so that's what I really liked about it but yeah I just washed my hair um I tried out new products but yeah, not bad, but it's literally late in the night and my hair is not dry yet. So, I don't know what I'm going to do because my hair is soaked, soaking wet. Um, so, I don't know. I think I'm going to like just put it up into like a high bun and then put um, my head scarf over it. So, yeah. But, honestly, my trip to Chicago was amazing. Def I will definitely go back there to experience more things. Maybe do it more on a less touristy level. And then even that, I didn't get to do a lot of the touristy stuff. So, definitely would go back there. Hopefully, I can ask, like, Brian or something to come with me. Because I think that would be cool. But, honestly, by, like, the day we had to leave, I was kind of over it. And not over it because, like... I wasn't having fun or I was annoyed with the girls or anything like that. Not at all. I, I was just over it because whenever it's that last day and you think about going through customs, you think about going on the plane ride home, packing your stuff up, and then just coming back home, it's just like, well, since I already have to go home, I might as well just, I wish I can just snap my fingers and be home. So whenever it's the, like the last day of a trip, that's just how I feel. It's because I hate the whole process of getting home. I just want to teleport or something so comment down below if you feel like that too whenever it's your last day you know on a trip do you just feel like Ugh, i just want to get home already even though you don't really want to go home but you kind of want to be home at the same time just because you know you have to go home that's how i feel but yeah hopefully my hair comes out good tomorrow i do have a few videos that i need to make so they can go up on my main channel i hope you guys are enjoying vlog -sember. i should be more on point with my videos now now that i'm home again I will have the time to edit, but then again, since I'm home, I'll be working and I don't really do much when I'm at home, so I'm going to try to do more content videos like I said. So if you guys have any suggestions of what you guys would want me to do, um, let me know. I do have a few already in mind because I read you guys' comments, of course, so definitely got to keep those in mind and get to work on those. So yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know we didn't do much. I didn't vlog that much, I should say, either. Um, it was pretty, hmm, okay vlog, but nonetheless, not every day is going to be super fun and dandy. So yeah, I will see you guys all in the next vlog.